like that. I've been sitting here a few moments, just taking all the ambiance, the burnished wood, the low lighting, the posters of Showfield girls uh, from the Zedgefield Follies, girls who are dead now, but God, look at those legs. <laughs> I look around, and I have a good feeling about this place, a better feeling than I've had about any place in a while. I come to this bar all the time. All the time. No one interesting ever comes here. I've passed by this place lots of times. I'm sure of that much. Lots of times before night. I really don't know why I never came in. It's like there's a sign on the door. Interesting guys, stay away. Pathetic morons are welcome. Maybe it was a name. <laughs> yeah, I guess that was it. Mr. Lucky. Once or twice I saw someone. Once or twice I saw someone, some guy. He'd walk in, sit down, nod at the bartender. I glanced over, flashed him my best cryptic smile. He glanced back at me, put his full force of his gaze on me, and there it was, written right on his forehead. More of the same. I was a little put off at first, you know? That's a lot of pressure to put on a guy. But now I think I can deal with it. I think I've gone through enough bad times that I'm ready for something good. Yeah. Mr. Lucky. <laughs> Mr. Lucky. Yeah, right. I guess that's why I came here in the first place. Came in off the dark street one night and popped my rear end on it, down on this overstuffed bar stool. Just to prove a point. To prove that the name was all crap. I think I'm more than And it's a heave you down from. Wow! <laughs> it's like he's one of those premium stations that I'm not supposed to be getting. <laughs> wow. I mean, wow. She is exactly. I'm afraid to look over again. I'm afraid that his face is going to fade out, or else there will be black lines across it. I mean, exactly. Exactly. You're crazy, Allison. Really crazy. You don't get this station. It's like she walked right out of my brain and sat down on that bar stool and ordered a drink. <laughs> See, a chunk of my brain is enjoying a drink there. <laughs> <laughs> What is that? Good, Allison. Good? <laughs> really? Real good. Beer nuts are good. Cheers, cheeseburgers are good. <laughs> Joe Crocker Live at the Hollywood Bowl is good. <laughs> but this is not good. One. See, this is the thing. See, this is the thing. I've talked to so many morons. I forgot what real people talk about anymore. <laughs> Will that eat with a knife and a fork? Can I get you another drink? No. Okay. I mean, I'm fine. Okay. N no. Thank you, but no. No, thank you. Uh, me too. <laughs> I'm high too. Oh. With my drink, I mean. Oh. Good. Yeah. <laughs> Good. 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 
They did something. <laughs> this is like a nightmare. I can't be this stupid. I can't be this stupid. I didn't mean to insult you. What? <laughs> I mean, I hope I didn't insult you before when I asked. Who says I felt insulted? Well, the tone of your voice. I thought maybe... No, believe me. I just wasn't insulted. Well, good. I'm glad. It's just the way you said no. There was just so much no in it. Believe me, you would know if I felt insulted. Yeah. Yeah, there'd be no doubt about it. Huh. I guess I was wrong then. I guess you were. So you have a real temper, huh? <laughs> I think that's good. I mean, healthy. You live longer that way. See, this is what I would have done if I felt insulted. 